He brought a gun to the sword fight, Chris. And honestly, that's changed. Okay, so I don't know where the other person is, but if I had to guess, it's probably there. But you know what? I might just take advantage here. Get a pallet out of the way. Just because of where they spawned, the box could be anywhere. I don't know if I want to waste time. Oh, there we go. Found it. Mage. <laughs> so that was great starting. Not in a position where we can do a manual break. Can get this. There we go. So now what we want to do is if Leon's smart, he doesn't solve yet. Oh, where was he? I wish I saw that. So Leon's all the way out there. He's having a hard time solving the box. You know what? Let's just take advantage. We're gonna take advantage. So close, so close. We want to keep this chain hunt going as long as we can. Now you must come with me. Okay, Fang was last seen over by that gen back there. We're gonna, we're gonna go for this. We're gonna go for this. Okay, lock me in, please. Thank you. Tried to fake it. Okay, so we know, I know where the box is. It's in the corner. So we ditch. She's having trouble solving the box. She's not following the three chain rule. Now she'll lose all box progress. Down. Another chain hunt. Never played Pinhead, so this is much needed. Uh, Adam, I have a video for you if you want it, where um, that guy I talked to to get all the info, this is all his advice. And I got it all down in one video. I'll, I'll link it in the chat uh, once we're done. Okay, so I wasn't paying as much attention as I should. I was hyper-focusing on this guy. I should have been looking around to figure out where the box was going to try and spawn next. But we're still in Chain Hunt. We're still... We've got a decent lead here. We're in a good spot. Okay, someone else is here. Okay, they're going for a rescue. That's fine. Like, I would have just stayed on Cheryl, but that was much better play. Oh, thank you. Oh, he's got DS. Like, it's not even something I consider people bringing anymore, but you know what? He made it work. Unfortunately, he stayed there. Uh, oh, shit. Okay. So, quite literally, you're playing for the box. Like... We'll hit Cheryl here, just to get her on the ground. But we know David has the box, we're not going to let him get away. I forgot how that tile worked. We're just going to ignore that, that didn't happen. Okay, so we've got the god pallet out of the way in the main building. So that means he's got nothing here. And basement skill, that's huge. Okay, so they're all over there, which gives a huge range for the box to spawn. Literally all of that half of the map, the box could spawn over there. Um, because we know that they were all in that corner. Okay, 
someone's got distortion. And it looks like they're running off there. So whenever we see a survivor running off, like into nowhere land, like Cheryl is doing, it's a pretty good chance she's running off to the box. Right, so we know that she picked up the box. We know that she was over here. So let's just take a quick look. There she is. And we got this. Right, once you watch him play Bennett and he played so bad, six survivors escaped. Yeah, because they kept they left with the box. The box is the fifth survivor. Now you got you do gotta be careful sometimes because whoever has the box might just be an absolute like mad lad and just be next level. But I don't think that's the case here. So we'll be okay. Uh, I forgot to do a quick spin. Um, so, again, we won't quite know where the box is, so we're going to have to make a guess based on where we see everyone else running. Okay. Uh, the person was close by. That guy's running off that way. So, again, like that half of the map. And since we have an, a relative idea of where it could be, we should be fine. Like, I think, I think Leon's probably going to prioritize the save, if I had to take a guess. Yeah, and again, it's out there now, so this will be the first time I lose the box. Because I wasn't just staying on top of it the whole time. Alright, so up we go. And now the box is going to be gone for about, I think, 45 seconds. If that's correct. Maybe not quite. No, or is it 45 seconds to the next... Uh, the next chain hunt. So, we've got a little bit of time here where the survivors can make all the plays they want to do. If they want to heal, they can heal. Right? They can... I was kind of expecting Dead Hard with how much that guy's looking back. Um, they've got a lot that they can play with here. They've got time. Okay, we're gonna go for the person in the back. Get her hooked. David's in the weaker spot, so let's go for David. The box is spawned, but I didn't get quite get enough information onto where it might be, so we just have to be sort of cognizant and try and stay center-ish in the map. All right, so they're all the way out there. And the thing is, I don't know if I can make that. No, no, I could have made that. I just, I hit the, I hit the one thing in the way. <laughs> Yeah, Fang, that's a love deserved tea bag. As if the one thing I could have hit, I hit. That's, that's so unfortunate, but also so hilarious. Alright, so she's up there. Uh, that's our distortion gamer gone, if I'm not mistaken. Or was I wrong? Maybe I was wrong. Doesn't matter, we see them running off that way. We are walking this way, so that's not a huge, a huge deal for us. Uh, we know the box is back there, but it hasn't spawned back yet. So we're hoping I can snag a hit here. There we go. And like, as you can see, right, the more we get the box, the more pressure we have, and the easier it is to find the next box, because we can judge where it's going to be, because it respawns faster. And at this point, I don't really care for the box. There's only two people left. We're not going to slug for the 4k. And so, yeah, no, we'll go for David. Because once we get... Once we're down to one person left, the, uh, the chain hunt stops, right? So we don't really have to care so much about what's going to happen next. Because all we have to do is hook David. Oh, please. 
no tears. They and are then waste we either good suffering. camp him because Leon can't do anything, or we go look for Leon. Um, ultimately, it doesn't really matter at this point. It's four gens left. I wouldn't be surprised if David gives up on Hook to try and give Leon Hatch. And I really just need to get better at looking around. Yeah, you didn't miss much. I found Leon. I hit Leon. Not sure what happened there. Alright, there we go. Uh, I was just saying when I went out, like, if ever anyone wants to see anything or wants to know how to do something, if I know how to do it, ask. And they'll give you the full walkthrough. Anyway, uh, what do we want to be sorry for this time? You want to be sorry for Pinhead? Sorry for the box? Sorry. GG, sorry, but that's my box. Alright. GG. Sorry. That's my box. Uh, good luck next one. These guys are also nice. <laughs> they get the joke. GG's dude was an incredible game. I'm literally planning to play Pinhead tomorrow and practice.